Hey everybody, it's me Katie and today I'm going to be showing you guys what is in my figure skating bag. I take this bag to the rink every single day with my figure skates and sharp blades in it, so it has to be pretty durable, so I got a little bit more expensive bag. It's a Lululemon bag and I actually got a gift card for my birthday, so I got this bag and it's a really, really cute bag. I'll pop up a picture right here. It's like a light orange pinkish color with black and gray on the outside and inside it's like light pink and dark pink. So it's a really, really cute bag. It's really durable and I really love it. So let's get started. So when I first open my bag, the first thing I will pull out are my hard guards. These things protect my blades from getting ruined when I'm not on the ice. They're just pink and blue and yellow and green and I just really love these. They're called rockers in the skating world. So these are my hard guards, ladies. The next thing I have in here is a pad bag. It's actually a makeup bag, but my grandma gets me all these makeup bags for free at her work. So she just gives me a lot of makeup bags, so I switch between many of them. So what's just in here is some pads. I have this circular one that goes on my bone right here, and then this bunga pad that goes right here. My feet are really sensitive, so I have to wear these pads every day, and I have some nylon socks that I wear too. All I have in here is some band-aids and some neosporin and stuff like that. So the next thing I have in here is a towel. I dry my skates with this when I'm done skating, and it says Da Ice Towel on it. I just thought that was really awesome, and that's why I got it. The next things you see are a most valuable part of skating, your figure skates. So the little things right here on my skates are called soakers. You put these on when you're not skating. You don't walk in these. They just protect your blades from not getting ruined or punching holes in your bag and stuff like that. So some signatures you may have noticed on my skates are from Olympians. And these two right here actually won the gold medal at the Olympics two years ago. I'm pretty sure it was two years ago. It's Charlie White and Meryl Davis. They were an ice dancing team and I just met them and I got their signature on my skates. Another signature is a lady who went to the Olympics. She is Ashley Wagner and she is one of my favorite skaters. Another signature on my other skate is from Gracie Gold. She also went to the Olympics and also is one of my favorite skaters. And no skater on that side is clean. It's very clean. The next thing I have in here are pucks. You may be wondering, Katie, why do you have pucks? Those are for hockey players. Well, these pucks actually are used for core exercises on the ice. The next thing I have in here is a head warmer. My coach gave me this for Christmas. So I sometimes use this when it's really cold in the rink and I just love the colors. And it's just really, really pretty. The next thing I have in here is a Nike knee pad. Remember in the last video when I said the last time I cried was because I fell on my knee a lot? Yeah, this is what that's for because my knee is so messed up I have to wear a knee pad because it hurts really, really bad when I fall on it. The next thing I have in here is a book. I just keep all of my skating stuff in here, like my warm-ups and what I do for jumps and stuff like that, and then spins, and then how I feel sometimes about a certain thing. The next thing in here is a moves in the field book. It has a lot of tests. If you're not a figure skater, you probably have no clue what this is. So it's just a test we have to do every little time. And I'm actually on the novice test for you figure skaters out there. And if you're not a figure skater, I have three more tests to go, including the novice, junior, and senior. The next thing I have in here is trusty old butt pads. So this one goes on your right cheek, that one goes on your left cheek, and this one goes on your tailbone. So trusty old butt pads, they're a little bit messed up because they've been falling on a lot. But they actually really, really help, but they make your booty look huge. That's the only downside. But yeah. The next thing I have in here is in the sock holder, I have some extra socks. They're really handy dandy if I get holes in my other socks, so I have these. Then a little zipper pocket, I have this um, snowman air freshener, because my feet are really stinky stinky, so it smells, smells like fruit, and I just have that in there, and I thought it was so cute because he has little ice skates on, and it's just the cutest little thing. And that's it for the middle section of that. And I have some pockets on the side. I have some extra hair ties. 
and then a minty lip balm. What's really cool is when you put on a minty lip balm on this and you go really fast, it feels so tingly and it's really, really cool. And then on the other side, I have some gloves. So two pairs of gloves, just in case I'm missing one. And then I have some rubber bands for my teeth. I actually have braces, so I have to wear my rubber bands. So I'm gonna keep those in there, just in case I forget to put them in in the morning. So that's pretty much it for my bag. Another really cool thing about this bag is it has some assigned placements for some random stuff. And it has a really inspirational quote on it saying, Soar today, strong tomorrow. And it has some other little pockets. Like in this one, it says, Keys, chapstick, and other easily lost items. You put that stuff in there. And then in this one, you put your phone right there. And then, I don't know if I can show you guys this. It says sunscreen right in this little one. And then it says some snacks in this little one. And then on the side, it has a weird little thing. It's for a hammock. You could put a little hammock in this one. On the other side, it says H2O, that's good. So you're gonna put your water in there. And then in this one, it says socks. This one, it says deodorant. This one, it says blister kit, which is really cool because I sometimes get a lot of blisters from new skates. I just think the random assigned placements for everything is really, really cute, and I just love my bag so much, and it's just the best bag ever. I hope all of you enjoyed the what's in my skating bag, and if you want to see a little thing in my blades, I will put it up right now because I know in the comments you're going to say, wait, show us our blades. Show us your blades. And guess what? Watch. I'm going to touch it. I'm going to touch the blade. I'm going to touch it. I'm going to touch it. I touched it. Everybody's like, why are you touching me? Like, I've been trained to. I hope you all have enjoyed this video, and I will see you next Saturday. Please like this video, comment what you want to see next, and subscribe. Love you guys so much. Bye.